Greetings fellow Flameborn. Today I'm going on a quest. I'm going off the grid. I am not streaming right now. I'm going to take a week off from streaming. I'm still going to make enshrouded videos. However, we are going to try to find a legendary, maybe a mystical, maybe a sword that doesn't exist. So the hat goes off, the glasses go on, and this button. There we go. So, actually, one thing that I want to test out before I tell you what the whole shebang or what the video is going to be about, I... If I go into the testing world, because I know there's a note that I haven't found, and it should be down in the volcano, which should be right here, maybe. Okay, so we're just gonna test this tiny little smidge of a thing out first, because this thing... I can't read this note, right? I completely fumble it. Pillars of creation, research site, ancients and the flame. Is that correct? Let's see. Ancients and the flame. No, it's not this one. The pillars of creation. All oh, right, it's the wrong one. Never mind. Never mind. Okay, so away with this world. Then again, you will never know that I fucked up because this is uh, this is a recording. It is not live. <laughs> right, okay, so back to the main world. Okay, and then I'm gonna explain what I'm doing. Okay, here we are. Right, so the thing is, I'm not streaming right now. And the sole reason is because we are searching for a sword. I've seen a picture or a screenshot of the sword approximately a month ago, maybe even longer. So I'm not sure if the sword even exists. The only clue that I have to go on is that it is a sword. It is supposedly the best sword that you can obtain in the game. And the sword is white without any kind of texture. And the icon for the sword, whoop, that's the wrong button. The icon for the sword is a staff and it doesn't necessarily say sword. So that is what we're searching for. I'm not sure why I'm looking over there. Usually that's where my Twitch chat is and it is not. Now it's just OBS. And I refuse to do any research on this purely because it's way more fun but twitch chat used to be right there now it's just obvious i'm just looking at myself and it's it's going to be a lonely journey but the project that i'm thinking of is that i'm gonna give myself one week to try to find this sword i have no idea where it is i'm not sure if it's in the game we will see it's uh it's going to be interesting i want to test myself and see if i can do this for one week without looking it up because if you've watched my channel, you might have known that I spent probably four days, close to six hours, just searching for Amber. Now, I finally cracked on the last hour, because like I had searched basically everywhere. I was going off memory, and my memory was wrong. Then again, I do recall maybe it was patched and the location was changed. And also, I had an entire episode where I was looking for Obsidian. But I did not do any research to find it. But this time I am not streaming. Purely because I don't want any assistance. Now of course you can comment down below. If what I'm doing is a waste of time. Or that you have found a sword. Or if it doesn't exist or whatnot. But the thing is. I'm not going to read the comments. For a week. So feel free to comment. I'm going to make my wife. I'm going to force her <laughs> to read all the comments. And respond if there's need to respond. But... I am going to stay off grid. I'm not gonna search for it. I'm not gonna Google it. Now well, that's gonna be fun. Now there is going to be a second objective, and that is I still miss a lot of lore. So we will see. That is what I'm gonna do for a week. Now that's gonna be anywhere between seven to fourteen hours of gameplay. Will I be able to find that sword? Maybe I won't. Maybe I'm wasting my time. But I think this is gonna be a fun challenge. And again, it's going to be a little bit hard not to stream, not to talk to anyone. I mean, I don't have that many concurrent viewers on Twitch, and I'm going to miss out on all those great deals from, you know, artists and graphic designers that want to sell me art. So that's that's going to be a shame, yes, a real shame. But I think that this, this is going to be fun. And also, it's a good way to experiment what it's like to make gameplay videos without doing it on Twitch, because the way that I usually make videos, oh, I'm gonna ramble on about this, is that I stream one to two hours on Twitch, 
I record at the same time. I cut down that video, edit it, maybe add some effects here and there, not that many. I think that this is going to be fun, especially for me. And it's going to be even more fun if I spend the entire week looking for something that doesn't exist. Will I be able to find this within, well, next Monday? I guess you will see. There's also a chance that I'm going to find it today. So who knows? That's a little bit bright. If I turn that slightly down, okay, I all of a sudden I became even more Caucasian. Yeah, right. Yeah, there is a chance that I'm going to find a sword today and <laughs> uh, there's not going to be a series, but just a single video. But let's give it a go. Okay, so first off, I am going to get rid of all of this. But since I am now recording and not streaming, I'm just going to go like so. <laughs> And there we go. Just like magic, it is all cleaned up. <laughs> that was cringe. Oh, good God. Right. Okay, so we're just going to start right off by going to the start of... Actually, we're going to go even further to the start and just start looking around. Now, there's going to be some adjustments because I have been streaming for, well, every day for four months. And that means that I am very used to talking non-stop because someone might might be listening i'm still looking over there there's nothing there except my obs i'm looking at myself i'm supposed to look over here at the youtube viewer not the twitch viewer so i'm going to look a lot over there it, it's going to be an adjustment one of the great things about not streaming on twitch is that i can without any kind of guilt just pause the video or pause the recording i mean i can do that when i'm live streaming like people sh should understand that I do have a baby and I have responsibilities that outweighs my need to play video games, but it is going to be easier now. And let's say I, I can be pantsless. I don't have to wear pants and my wife can walk behind me totally naked without me having to worry about it. So we will see. I will continue streaming, but I'm going to take one week away from streaming and just focus on this. I might be wasting my time. But it could be very fun that it can be. And again, I need to remember, I don't need to talk. I, uh, unless I have something important to say. But we will see. We will see, won't we? I have never gone this route before. Well, this is a little bit interesting. I have never noticed this before. There you go. Like, I've done loads and... You're fucking kidding me. <laughs> I've done so many exploration videos. Like, seriously, there was a note right here, right in the beginning of the area, that I have never discovered. Oh my god. Well, this is gonna be a fun series. Oh yeah, okay, what is this then? Ode to Pikemen. Okay, Nobles and History, Drinking Song. Do I get a quest? Drinking Song? Well, I might as well try to sing this thing, eh? Okay, <clears throat> I'm joking, I'm just gonna read it. Get around, we're drinking, an ode to the queen, once young. Three babes on her arm, cup filled to the brim, thinking out loud, she sung. Rather mead in my cup, or my cup filled with rum, drink too much rather than be done. Can't only have some to sh so share some around. Drink too much rather than drink one, rather mead in my head, and, huh? and my head onto the run then my head on a pike with none get the rum and the mead get the mead in the cup get the cup in your head drink up if you're watching this video and you just read that and you listen to me read this thing make a song out of it yes yes quite but there you have it okay i just started in this <laughs> this series and already it has paid off immensely even if i don't find the sword of legends <laughs> it's already worth it Okay, now it's night. Now, when I went into this cave, it was day. When I got out of it, it is now night. That is because one of the other reasons that I'm not... I'm, I'm still trying to look at chat, but I'm only looking at my own face. Okay, this is going to take some time. You are over there. There's no one here except me. You're over there, right? Okay, so one of the reasons that I also want to try this project is because my daughter has... Dis discovered my streaming schedule and it goes without fail almost every day as soon as i start streaming it goes approximately half an hour and uh, she starts to get a little bit fussy not directly screaming or crying but she wants her father and that's me and so we <laughs> almost without fail every day i have to pause or put on a be right back sign on my twitch 
to, you know, deal with her. But now, since I am just recording and not live streaming, I can, you know, just pause the, uh, pause the video recording and start anew. Now, I am going to continue searching in the dark because it could help a little bit. It's, oh, it is easier to spot lore in the night. Like, I know there's something here. What is over here? That is... Nobles in history, low level... Okay, nobles of history. Let's uh, have a look-see. Nobles in history. What do I miss over here? Caravan Longkeep. Ocean's Heart, eh? Hmm. That is down in the Kindle Waste and Brittle Brush. So it is probably in Brittle Brush somewhere. I have searched that entire area. Yeah, okay, we'll see. I must say, I find it a little bit hard not to talk consistently. But I do feel like I am going to be a little bit more concise with what I am saying. Probably not in the first couple of videos. So far, it is fun. I have found a little bit of lore in unexpected places. Okay, and now I have searched the entirety of Longkey, but I just had a thought. I mean, we are searching for the legendary sword. A mythic sword. Uh, henceforth known as Excalibur. We are searching for Excalibur. There is a chance that I could already have the sword. Why am I looking over there? You're over there, right? I'm gonna repeat myself a lot. Okay, let's have a look-see. It's none of these swords, I think. No, but it is not a two-hander. No, it could it well be a staff. That's a staff, 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 okay. Okay, so we don't have the sword. I mean, at least that's good. <laughs> I mean, I you're not over there, you're over there. I kind of want to make a series out of this. It would be fun to find it on the first day that I, <laughs> that I started this project, but we'll see. Okay, we're just gonna head back to the beginning. Okay, so we've investigated Longkeep. It is probably not here. It could be in a random chest. It could be random loot. It could be in a specific chest. That is also why we are searching for lore, because if I find lore, that means that I haven't been there. So we're gonna search gonna search a lot. Now I think a good strategy is probably to follow the roads, because all the roads leads to Rome, like this place. I've been here a couple of times. It would be weird if I hadn't. Okay, here the chest is open. Wait, there's an executioner axe. I think that we're gonna be a little bit tactical about this, because this is scavenger playing pranks. If I go into the lore, where's scavengers? Playing pranks, okay, that's just two pages, right? I mean, it wouldn't make sense that those papers were in scavenger camps, right? Like, here's a bat cave. No, I don't think that I've been down here, but this is just flintstone. That's a spider. What is a spider doing here? Oh yeah, this is this little area. Hmm, loads of spiders. Okay, peaceful acres. Well, nothing here, <laughs> but I do remember this bed. Uh, in one of my first videos, or the first time I was here, I was frantically looking for a bed since it was dark and I couldn't find it. I mean, I would assume that the staff has high damage, at least. So I guess it's not in the beginning area. Then again, it could be. But if it is hidden somewhere here, I mean, someone would have made a video about it, right? Again, I haven't searched, so who knows? Here's a cave. Where the hell does this cave go? Oh, hang on a minute. Yeah, this cave. This cave is a uh, nothing cave, right? Yeah, there's nothing in here. Not a marker, no nothing. Why? There's only a chest. Wait, nothing? Huh. That's uh, strange, isn't it? Now, I do remember being in this cave a very long time ago, and I didn't find nothing then uh, either. Huh. Okay, I have Discord open on my other monitor, so... Uh, I just... I re react like it's Twitch chat, but it's not. I think I need to put that away. There we go. Fantastic. Right. Okay, so where was we? I just will put this a little bit closer. Uh, okay, where to next? Maybe scavenger stash. I know that I'm in there, but yeah, we're just moving slow and steady upwards. Now, it would be incredibly weird if I did find it in this area. Scavenger stash. But this is just a wailing blade. It is a good sword, that it is. Again, could it be just random loot from... I mean, it could be, right? I mean, there is a chance that I've already gotten the Excalibur and just not known it. 
and I have maybe dismantled it. Must sword. Hang on a minute. Yeah, I do believe yeah, it looks like this, except it's entirely white, and I do believe that it's a little bit thicker. Now, I wish I had a picture of it so that I could show what I'm looking for, but I have not found it on the Discord. <laughs> okay, maybe I'm insane. Maybe I've dreamt about this. And worst case scenario, we don't find the sword and we just explore, which is a series within itself, because I do need some lore. Okay, I'm finding a lot of uh, explosives that I am. What, he didn't die? Jesus. I know that I'm not specced into ranger but damn i thought i would at least do something ah this place takes me back it's one of the first deaths i had in the game because i thought i could just fly over there and that i didn't lose stuff but i did and it was red shroud yes like this this would also be fun to just have like a slide hey, you can't like double jump up this thing so that would be good for parkour courses Oh yeah, speaking of discovering stuff, here in Woodguard is the place that you can get the flower soil, which is green all over and works great for terrain building and such. It only took me one episode to find this, but also I had a picture that was somewhere in, in my mind. You're not over there, you're over there, right? Yeah, so I went by a picture, but this time I only have a picture of someone wielding a white sword and the icon down at the hotbar was a staff. So it's gonna be a tricky, tricky quest. Again, right now I'm just exploring lower level areas. So most likely it's not here. I mean, it should be in the latest stage of the game. Maybe. Hang on, hidden doorway. Not sure if I found that last time. Okay, what's in here? That's just a chest, but it goes down behind it. Come on, give me something. Heal channel, eh? Okay, so what is this? This, uh... It's, it's a hidden something, but... Yeah, it's just down. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna dig straight down. Yeah, sure. I mean, that was a very hard rock. Come on, dig. Why can't I dig? Uh, what is this? What is this magic? Why can't I dig down? I mean, I can, but it ex it's extremely hard rock. Okay, if I do it in the dirt, then, like, right here. Yeah. Okay, this goes a little bit faster. Okay, so some rocks are harder than others. And I only get one stone. What the hell is going on? Uh, I do need stone. But if it's gonna take me five hits every time... No, you know what? You know what? No, 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 no. Okay, so this is ultra hard stone. I think that I'm gonna go down. Meow. Yeah. Creature's nest. There is a legendary chest over here. Yeah. Wait, that's just a bow, right? Yeah, they, <laughs> these small creatures are <laughs> uh, cute but annoying. I, I mean, in order to make this a little bit more cinematic, I could just do it like so. Eh, maybe that's the plan. Maybe I should do the entire series like this. Ah, then again, it would be harder for me to find secret doors. I mean, it is a beautiful looking game that it is. Yeah, I can't really see if I can loot stuff or not. Yeah, okay, I think that I'm gonna use the HUD a little bit. Okay, let's head up to Willow's Crush and then Grind Teeth Grotto. Oh, hang on, this is the same kind of pot that was inside the doors. Like the big doors that you have to explode open. Hang on, okay, so here you can get three of the mysterious flasks in Willow's Crush. I mean, if you just place down a flame altar. What is that light? That's weird. And I've exploded this once, might as well do it again, because explosions is fun. It's a lot of red stuff around me. Yeah. A little bit hard to see, and I am traveling quite fast. Right, because underneath this rubble there should be a chest, right? Because logic. Yeah, there's a chest. Okay, is there anything here? Copper arrows. I mean, it, it, it is something. Oh, I don't know, this looks like amber. It is amber. Oh, okay, so you can find some amber here too. I don't think there is anything else interesting around this area. Maybe, maybe not. I mean, it's very hard to see in the shroud. Oh, well, would you look at that here? Eh? Okay, a hidden chest. Could Excalibur be in here? Riptide? Uh, what? New lore. Okay. General Gift of the Tide. Oh, okay. Riptide. I have not seen this thing before. Nine block poison resistance, eh? I mean, I have the magical one. And this is more parry power. Okay, now how does this look? Okay, 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 that's uh, that's something. So we did find, well, just one piece of lore and a fancy shield. So, I mean, we didn't find Excalibur today, but maybe tomorrow. Again, you're not over there, you're over there. I 
am over there where Twitch chat used to be. But alrighty. Okay, so this is gonna be an interesting adventure, I think. It's gonna be a little bit weird not <laughs> to stream for a week, but I think it's gonna be fun. But I think that I'm gonna say, as always, until next time.